Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. This uh, simulation, the QTAM action? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, the False Claims Act? Yes. Mm -hmm. I thought for sure that when law enforcement realizes that the petitioner? Yes. Didn't declare to the court the stipulation and order? Mm -hmm. You would have immediately removed all the fraud of all your court orders? Yes. Now, I don't see it on the public court record. No. And I'm concerned that you continue to abuse me. Yes. Because I'm living in a location. Right. That was open to me because of a burglary. Yes. Where I was put in a very vulnerable place again. Mm -hmm. Because of the closing of the Serenity House. Yes. Where I had lived at another location where I was uh, abused. Yes. And was very vulnerable. Ouch. And then when moving to the rental house, yeah, mm -hmm. uh, the individual I was going to work with uh, suffered a physical ailment yes, that made it impossible for him to continue with the work that we had planned on doing. Yes. Now, when renting this room, mm -hmm. I made particularly sure, yes, of my rights as a renter. Yes. And as much as I appreciate the landlord, because I do, uh -huh, I had no place to live. Yes. I had stayed up all night uh, making videos and documenting numerous crimes. Mm -hmm. If she were to die, I'd be in that vulnerable place again. Yes. Where the landlord decided who gets to live there. Oh, because it's her house. Mm. Now, I do have certain rental rights, and I just wanted to reiterate to law enforcement. Yes. That I made sure that they understood that I was a boarder. Yes. And the landlord was paying all these utilities, and all I got, yes, was a bed to sleep on and a television to watch, yes. And somebody had broke the remote control. <clears throat> now, um, non-refundable if evicted, ooch, or rental agreement is voided, yeah. Now, I don't want to be evicted because of the simulated deception, yes, of somebody that feigns that they... <laughs> are a victim of domestic violence. Mm -hmm. I have paid particularly close attention, yes, to the individuals that I have resided with. Yes. <laughs> I've respected their privacy, oh, and they've respected mine. <clears throat> and um, I just wanted you to know, yes, I've lived there since November 15th of 2018. Yeah. And I'm in the grace period, yes, because it's after the 7th of the month. Hooch. Now, I'm sure happy that I got last month's rent paid. Yes. And the month of August rent paid. Yes. <laughs> but it seemed that the individuals that have been paying the rent <laughs> do not really appreciate how kind the landlord <laughs> really is. <laughs> now, I want you to understand that when I said I want to move, yes, I want you to stop simulating and start doing what the law says. That means I'm going to sue you. And uh, for the United States of America that doesn't think that I have any concerns about this nation. Yeah, I have a great amount of concern of you refusing to acknowledge the rights of citizens. Yes, I have a, a great amount of concern that there's no stipulation in order right now. Mm -hmm. There's no stipulation in order during the dissolution of marriage. Pooch, that I didn't get any notice of court hearings. Right. I have a great amount of concern that the United States of America.